everyone, it's Karen here to share with you one of my latest purchases from Amazon. My Mixpresso coffee maker came in. This is a personalized coffee maker and I got it because I'm taking this to my office to keep at my desk. I'm not crazy about the uh, office coffee in the break room. I am a little picky when it comes to coffee, so I like to brew my own coffee, which is why I bought this personalized coffee maker. I love the size of it. You'll see that it's really compact and it's this nice red color, so it's a little stylish here. But what this does is it you just plug and go. It's a personalized coffee brewer. I'm gonna open it up and I'm gonna show you what it has inside. This is the brew basket. You can see right here, this wire mesh brew basket, which is great. I don't have to buy coffee filters for it. I can just reuse this after washing it. And then this is the container that holds the brew basket that sets inside here. That's where I will put my coffee grains to make my coffee. And this is the water tank you can see right here. What I like about this, it also comes with its own insulated mug so you can brew the coffee straight into your mug, grab it and go. The insulated mug also comes with a lid that you can open and close to drink your coffee. It will keep it warm and keep it from spilling. To make my coffee, I fill my insulated coffee cup that comes with the coffee maker with water. And then I pour that water right here into the coffee tank. And the amount of water you use determines the size of the cup of coffee you want to brew. I am going to brew a large one. So I fill the water all the way up to the top, filling the water tank all the way up to the top. And I'm going to put the cup underneath the uh, coffee brewer. And then I'm going to fill the wire mesh basket with coffee grains. I like strong coffee, so I'm going to fill my coffee filter basket up almost to the top with coffee grains. I give it a little room. I don't fill it all the way to the top because coffee grains need room to expand when you're brewing coffee, but I like my coffee really strong. So there we go, three tablespoons of my favorite coffee. Close the lid and now to operate it to turn it on super simple all you're going to do is you're going to press this button right here and see it turns blue that means it's on and it is ready to brew coffee is brewed it took three minutes to brew this large cup of coffee and you can see i say large because it's almost all the way to the top that's the quantity that i brewed and i did that in three minutes. Now it's time to taste the coffee. Mm. It's good. Nice and strong. Just how I like it. So I'm going to put my top on, grab it and go. Check it out. If you're looking for something portable, easy and uh, brews pretty decent coffee in like three minutes.